So guys, uh, we have a problem in South Africa. Right here, I have an article from Business Tech, businesstech.co.za. I love to read this website news. It's for business. So let me just read. Uh, I took some little information. Investors flooding out of South Africa. And they have a picture of the president here. I hope you can see. They have a picture of the president. Investors flooding out of Afri South Africa. It was this article was released on the 12th March 2023 by Mason Duplessis. So it says it reads as follows: International investors have had enough of South Africa, yo, and are taking large sums of their money out of the embattled country. The City Press reports that over 100 billion rand in South African shares and bonds have been sold by international investors since the start of 2023. So, that's a lot of money, guys. That's hefty load of money. 100 billion rand in South African shares and bonds have been sold by international investors since the start of 2023. J.C. Lowe, the CEO of DFM Global, told the publication that this is a clear signal of investor sentiment, investor sentiment turning for the worst. Yeah, this is all that I can have, that I can say. So we have a problem in South Africa. Investors are flooding out since 2023, start of 2023. Uh, 100 billion rands have been sold. Over 100 billion rents in south african shares and bonds have been sold by international investors since the start of 2023 in this case selling selling meaning sold it's either they sold their share their shares and bonds and then in order for them to to move away to the other count uh overseas or whether they they are still intact in the market of south africa but they decided to sell on the certain investment they, they, that they invested in so if they are selling they mean they're predicting Let's say, let's say, for instance, I'm selling the stock company Samsung. Samsung, the stock company, I'm, I'm deciding to place a sell order on my broker, the stock market broker. I'm deciding, uh, I'm deciding to sell. So it meaning I'm, I'm anticipating that the Samsung company will, will decline and lose value. You understand? So that's the first case, the, the first scenario. The second scenario, it's either they pull in their money and then they flew away and have they want nothing to do with south africa anymore so south africa have been affected over 100 billion rand in south african shares and bonds have been sold by international investors since the start of 2023 so at the start of 2023 100 billion dollars 100 billion rent left south africa what will happen in the next six months what will happen in 2024 so it's it's really hectic it's hectic we could see a lot of changes coming in into south africa we'll just have to bear bear and then look what's happening and then implement uh, this is just what's happening investors flooding out of south africa so there you have it guys cheers